what's going on everybody it's Letitia with barefoot gardening I hope that you are doing well so I am out looking at one of the community gardens in my area it's not quite um, my city is uh, made up of little cities okay and so it's not in my little city in the city <laughs> <laughs> but it's not that far from my house it's about uh, five minutes really it's, uh, six minutes from my house and so I'm just looking at they have some available plots here and I'm just looking I, I don't know if I want to uh, garden uh, necessarily in a community garden but I'm open to that because I got some things coming down the pike y'all that um, I just need to prepare for and so I'm just out doing some research, but a lot of corn. Look at all this corn. Um, so I'm not sure who's renting what, you know, you don't know, but there's tons of corn out here in this community garden. Um, more corn. <laughs> more corn over here. I mean, goodness grief. Uh, when you come into the garden, there's a lot of uh, flowers um, you know a lot more you know you see a lot more um, pollinator gardens and things like that but honey whoever rented out these plots um, are in the business of growing corn sorry y'all I didn't mean to have the camera up but um, I've only seen one and I just paid attention to that but I've only seen one water source there must be more yes here's another one okay so it looks like maybe every five or six plots um, they have a source of water, but look at all the corn, honey. So I'm just looking, I'm just looking. Um, I just saw, oh, there's some tomatoes, um, and a Hispanic individual. And it looks like this is going back towards someone's house. It actually does look like someone lives here. This plot is all, um, I don't know if they grow here or if they're just maybe weeding laid some plastic down to get the weeds but yeah i'm just looking oh there's a lady over here garden meeting let's see what that says garden meeting friday july 17th 10 a.m uh okay all right so let me talk to this lady real quick and see what's going on hello how are you good i'm just looking around it's beautiful um, are you in charge here? Huh? Are you in charge? No. Okay. Do you live here? Huh? Do you live here? Huh? Yes. Okay. I can park my car here if I want. Okay. So yeah, she she's just uh, hanging out. Um. Yeah. So it goes back. I wonder if they have any plots I mean it looks like it does but it goes it goes on around um, and it, that actually looks like somebody's residence so I'm not sure where it start starts and stops but uh, yeah I'm not gonna stay <laughs> I'm not gonna stay she didn't know what I was saying um, but I'm excited I'm excited so what I really am looking for you all is a plot where I can put up a high tunnel um, and I was so sure that I'm, I could get one on my land, but I'm not going to be able to put a high tunnel on my land. Not that. And, um, so, so that's kind of what I'm looking for. And, um, and I think I'm going to be able to do that. Another thing is, um, my area in my city, um, my little city, <laughs> there isn't a community garden. And so I was thinking about starting one starting a community garden um, in my little city they have a small 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 farmers market um, but it's not even going this year I guess the guy decided not to do it because of um, you know COVID and everything um, they have some poke growing in there and looks like pepper plants a lot of pepper plants there um, some squashes uh, but uh, but yeah so this 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 plot is all fenced in okay he wants you to notice he is all right um, but um, let's see that boot is just killing me cracking me up oh my gosh so this is plot a six seven okay I see but it's it's this is like <laughs> yeah they they uh 
yeah this corn honey this corn um oh <laughs> I'm going over a speed bump. These shoes. What is the purpose of the shoes? Somebody tell me. I don't know. And then I guess it's their garden shoes. <laughs> Look at all the shoes. Can y'all see that? Oh no. Okay. So anyway, um, this farm or this uh, community garden um, is like a you know again not that far from my house. But I'm thinking about starting one because we, we don't have one in our little city inside the big city. And so, um, you know, it, it might be fun to, to do that. And there's organizations here that will help you get everything started. There, You know, I don't have to do all the work myself, which is pretty dope, um, and give you the funding uh, for it. Um, and if you need to, like put in water catchment systems and things like that there are there's funding for that already so i don't have to do a whole whole lot of research i already know the organization i know um what they offer so it's just about like finding a space to do it in right and um and then being in charge um is something else i got to think about like do i have the time yes i have time but i also don't want it to be um something that i you know i'm completely in charge of on my own i think it would take a lot of community you know just everybody working together and so hence a community garden but yeah but yeah this is so dope i see all the beans got some beans and sunflowers and some tomatoes that are vining around and doing their thing you know the tomato plants not staked up are so pretty they're so pretty but uh, let me let this person in look like they trying to come in and i will talk to y'all later thank y'all so much for watching bye